Hello fellow Harley Quinn fans, today I am customizing a Harley Quinn H&M bag. If you like watching these videos, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Also leave a comment down below as to what you are currently working on. So this is an older bag of mine. It is from H&M. It is not leather. It is in fact polyurethane. However, we are going to treat it just like leather. And it is super cute, goes with everything, and the perfect size for Harley Quinn. With the image printed out and glued to a piece of blue Sorrel transfer paper, I'm ready to transfer my image. There is an Amazon affiliate link to the transfer paper that I use down below in the description. Place something hard just beneath the surface to help you guide your pin along the lines a little bit faster and a little bit easier. Because I'm treating this polyurethane just like leather, I need to remove the factory finish. I am using acetone on this and I need to keep the acetone confined to this area only, otherwise it will leave a discoloration along the other sides of the purse. This acetone is just basic nail polish remover. You can use any form of acetone as long as it removes the finish. I am doing so with a Q-tip. My first coat is Flat White from Angelus Direct. As you can see, most of my line work has disappeared. At this point, you can redraw the lines using the original Sorrel chalk stencil or just wing it as I am doing. In the end, it took four coats of the flat white to get it as solid as I needed it to be. Cutting out Harley from my original Sorrel stencil and tracing her in the center of what I just painted. This chili red from Angelus Direct is very thin, so I need multiple coats, while the black I'm able to do in one shot. The blue chalk can be removed using a pencil eraser.
line work time. in this Harley Quinn image I just painted onto this H&M bag with a satin fur coat. And this is the complete Harley Quinn H&M bag. If you have any questions, you can reach out to me through my Instagram or my website. Both links are down below, as are links to all the products I use in this video. Big thanks to Angelus Direct for the paints, and thanks guys for watching.